Hello, my lovely trilobites. I've missed you. I've been under the weather, so I really haven't been able to get out and do a proper haul video in quite a while. Um, I was fortunate enough to get strep throat with huge antibiotics as kind of a bonus birthday present. So I've been really bored and laying around in bed and eating ice cream and sleeping and, and being very sadly unproductive, which is not good. So <clears throat> now we're done with the antibiotics and on the, you know, we're, we're good. We're getting there. I'm getting caught up. So here's the haul that is way overdue. So I apologize for that. So let's get right into it because I like short videos. I found like the Beekman Black Goat Milk Serum and the Pure Goat Milk Cream. They actually have a lot of Beekman products, which I was Kind of surprised. I'll see them here and there intermittently, but not in that volume. They had a bunch of the MAC Go Play blushes. They had a ton of the NARS Climax Extreme Mascara. Lashes from Sephora. Those are at Marshalls. They're $7.99. They also had a ton of different lashes from Morphe. Like they have the Brentwood ones, the DTLA, the Hollywood Hills. They have a whole bunch of those and they're only like $3.99 a pair. So if you, this is like the season of lashes. There's like so many lashes now and I really still have yet to figure out how to put them on correctly. There's like a bunch of, bunch of Living Proof hair care products, Sephora line. I'm seeing a lot more of the Sephora line in the stores now. I'm also seeing a lot more like Burberry. Okay, so at TJ Maxx, they have like the huge the huge Halloween beauty concept palettes, like the the R.I.P. to the girl I used to know and the I Put a Spell on You and they have the Simpsons one. So much Morphe. They had like the Morphe Ashley Strong collab, the Morphe Constellation Sky. They had Morphe everything. So much Morphe. <clears throat> they also had the Revolution Mad Love like cheek palette. We still found like the normal... Like Fenty and ABH Norvina palettes and stuff like that. And then we found there was the Jacqueline and Morphe. And then the Mickey and Morphe. And the 9H, 9T, 9V, 9D, 35S, 35P, 35XO, 18A. I mean, th th this was like a Morphe invasion. Then we found like the Morphe 2 Lippy TLC. So it comes with like three different products in there. And that was the all of this stuff was was very, very inexpensive. Uh the palettes I think were what like between like ten and fifteen dollars, maybe, if that. So anyway, there's like more Milani, more Mac, more NARS, more Morphe, and then more Sephora. And then they had a ton of Too Faced, which I'm seeing more and more of. They have like the ultimate lip primer, lip injection, the instant and long-term lip plumper, lip injection, the extra strength instant and long-term lip plumper, maximum plumper. All of those were between like $5.99 and $7.99 and they had like a whole selection of them. So if you need any Too Faced lip injection anything, I definitely recommend TJ Maxx. They had a bunch of origin stuff too. Uh, I normally see some origins but not this much. It's kind of like... This is almost similar to the cosmetics company outlet because I see a lot of Too Faced there and I see a lot of Origins there and I see a lot of MAC there. So it's kind of giving me like that kind of vibe, I guess. Then I found a bunch from Misa and the packaging just looks really, really pretty. And there's like the stuff and I have, yeah, there's, there's a picture because I, and then they had like a ton of Pixie, like tons of Pixie kits, the vitamin C one, the rose one, the body glow one. I mean, they, it was like another Pixie invasion as well. They had more from uh, Philosophy and Nature in a Jar, like the kind of the more fall scents as well. <laughs> Obviously, ton of the, the o Onyx or ONYX scrubs, pretty much every flavor scent combination. I mean, it, there's just piles and piles of these. Sorry, I found a Atelier Cologne in Pacific Lime, which I thought was kind of interesting. And then I also found they had a bunch of the 
pony effect makeup and I don't really know anything about this brand I probably should have googled it um, but the packaging looks really interesting and this one's in the shade warm breath that's creepy all right and these were only $5.99 but I don't really know anything about this brand so let me know if you've tried it because I have I have not I don't even know where that came from I did find a bunch of stuff from Sunday Riley which I was really excited about because this stuff is like usually really expensive at Sephora and Ulta and it's like $12.99 we found even more Morphe are we shocked no but this one's the quad gold I think I don't know this is like the stuff from last year but this was $5.99 and it's like a mint, a multi palette, so I guess you get like eyes, cheeks, lips, and sparkle. And I don't know, it's just I like cubes. I'm I'm guessing this was like the holiday collection from last year, maybe. So you get like a sparkle thing, and then what are our categories? Oh, eyeshadow, and then we get a blush. Then we get a lippy that has weird bubbles on it. Oh, oh no, 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 no. That is that is definitely not going on my lips. Um, that looks like it's from Christmas of like last year, and uh, that that is not going. Nope, 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 nope. I just got done with antibiotics. We're not even gonna go there. And then I guess this is Champagne Rose Sparkle. Um, this one doesn't appear to be bubbly or creepy like the lippy in here. Yeah, that lippy, that that does not look um, normal to me at all. Nope, nope, that, nope. I'm, well, I could swab that and put it in a petri dish and see what comes of it. Because that's actually kind of curious to me. But no not gonna go there that's not going on my lips this i bought literally purely for the packaging okay like look this blue and it's like this cushiony thing and it looks adorable and it's supposed to be like this cushion foundation in the shade 68161 i'm like is that a zip code that could be a zip code i'm sure that is someone's zip code and the shade natural so i have no idea what this is but for 3.99 like i'm just really curious because if this shade doesn't work like I could totally you know take the stuff apart even though it says talk free I can still take it apart and then put something else in here and just like have this cool little mirrory compact you know so that's kind of where I was thinking of this if like the shade is horrific total packaging purchase some claw clips in the shape of bows because I break mine because I fall asleep reading and then I roll over and then it cracks against my head and the pillow and I basically break them non-stop. Butterfly ones and I'm like oh these are gonna be so adorable and, and they smell really good and the packaging's really cute. I like the gnomes and they're only like $2.99 so yeah that's what I got. Sorry this took so long to film. I'll edit it and make it a whole bunch shorter and uh, thank you for watching and please like and subscribe because that really helps out my tiny little channel here and that's all I got so have a great weekend and a great week and stay safe okay bye